John Tuckner is the founder of Secure Annex. They've recently got a lot of press coverage about some malicious VS Code extensions that they've found, Ransom Vibe and Sleepy Duck. I, of course, wanted to ask John about these specifics because it's very interesting. So I asked John, why are developers themselves being targeted and not so much applications or infrastructure? I think when you end up on a developer endpoint, there's a lot more to be done than just ending up in somebody's code. And it's not to say that running something in NPM can't compromise a developer endpoint either. So when you actually compromise uh, one of those endpoints, it's almost like you have a yeah, admin uh, level machine into an organization. And most of the time, developers do have that level of right given to them just because they're the ones creating the code that creates the company money, right? And so I think that's why the focus is on what's a way that I can one click get remote code ac execution into developer machines, uh, the code marketplaces.